All right, I'm going to show you how to change the dimensions of an image you're working with as well as add in borders and just in general manipulate the image inside Keynote. So going ahead and open up Keynote. I'm going to choose a white background. It doesn't really matter because you can always change it later. I'm going to erase all this stuff. Don't need it. And then I'm going to change the dimensions. So I'm just setting up my Keynote. Uh, so that it's much larger, that way it lessens the likelihood of images pixelating when I'm manipulating them and saving new images. Then I'm going to drop in the image I'm working with. In this case, I'm working with a logo that is a JPEG and it has a black background. You'll notice here in a little bit, it's not entirely black, but I'm going to change that just to make it look a little bit better. So let's say you wanted to create a white border around this. Now, I have a white background here, so I'm not going to be able to tell if I actually have a white border. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to put this behind it. Go to Format, Arrange, send it to the back. Then I'm going to change the color to a color that is not inside the logo, so I can clearly see the difference between this, this, and this. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add in another shape here. Okay, and I'm going to make it white. And I'm going to throw it behind here, just like that, backwards. And now, voila, you've got a border right there. So that was really easy. So in order to save this, I'm just going to select both these things. And then I'm going to open up Preview, which if you have a Mac, then this will be uh, on all your devices. Then you just go up to File, New Clipboard. And then there it is, exit, and then you can save it as a PNG or a JPEG, whatever you want. And there it is, my image now has a white border. Okay, but if you wanted to change the dimensions, oh, that was the wrong thing to open. If you wanted to change the dimensions, what you would do is this. Let's say you're like, you know what, I want this to be tall instead of, you know, landscape. I want it more in portrait mode. What you're going to do is grab this, let's stretch it up here, and you're like, all right, well, this looks black, so let's change this to black. Okay, that looks pretty good. Well, there's this weird border here, so let's get rid of this. You're going to hit image, edit mask, and you're going to drag this in and get rid of the border. Okay, and this is going to make it look a lot better, but you'll notice there is still an issue we have two different colors happening here between here and here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna match it. So I'm gonna click the box and I'm going to click the little dropper here and match the color. See, I'm clicking right here and now, boom, it is the same exact color. Now, I can just select these two things, go to preview, file, new from clipboard, and then I can save it. All you do is hit exit, and then I'm going to say this is two. And you know what? I'm going to say this is a JPEG because some platforms, like sometimes Facebook, prefers JPEG over PNG. And now you can see it right there. Or you can do that. And that is pretty much it. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments. Please like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos like this. Thanks.